Welcome viewers, my name is Leslie Waterhouse. I'm a member of the Noka Blaine Coon Rapids Area League of Women Voters, a nonpartisan organization that works to inform and educate voters. Joining us today to provide voting information is Anoka County Elections Manager, Tom Hunt. We're here to talk about serving as an election judge. Tom, who can be an election judge? Sure, so anyone who is an eligible voter in Minnesota and over the age of 16 can actually be an election judge. Uh, so for, for students who want to be an election judge, those 16 and 17 year olds, they would just need a couple extra pieces of information. So they, they would need a permission from their parents and from the, the principal of their school. And then they can go in and serve on election day just like anyone else. There's, a, there's only a couple jobs that they wouldn't be able to do because some jobs require uh, your party affiliation and that's not something that we need from younger folks. But, but other than that, they could do everything else at the polling place. So, so yeah, anyone who's an eligible voter can be an election judge. And what type of training is there? To be an election judge, there is about two hours of training that needs to take place. And most of that is online. We have a, a training program that where people can just log in and watch the videos and, and get the training that they need. If you wanted to be an assistant head judge or a head judge at a polling place, then there's an extra hour of training that you would need to, to take. But it's, it's really nothing too crazy. Um, and if you ever feel like you know, there's a lot of information and you, you need a little extra, you can always come into our office and we'd be more than happy to kind of walk you through some of the machines or, or ex any extra training that you might need. And what is the time commitment? The, the time commitment, uh, so election day, the polls open at 7 a.m., but the, the election judges do show up at 6. So you would get there at 6 a.m. to set up the polling place. And then most judges do work the, the full day. So a lot of times, you know, polls close at eight, but you may not be done packing up everything and transmitting the results until, you know, nine o'clock, 10 o'clock, potentially. So it can mm -hmm. be a full day. If you need to do a half day, we can, we could potentially work with that as well, but yeah. Is there any other important information you would like to share about being or serving as an election judge? Sure, we, we get a lot of great feedback from election judges. So it's, it's a lot of fun. You get to work together as a team throughout the day and, and be a part of the, the democratic process. So that's, that's a big benefit for a lot of judges. They want to serve their community. Um, so I would definitely encourage anyone that, that wants to be a part of that. And if you're a younger person as well, it's, it's something great to put on your resume also. Um, so, so yeah, I, I would encourage anyone to apply to be an election judge. Well, thank you for being here to share that information. Thank you. 